Hello YouTubers, um, I'm going to show you how to load um, a Polaroid film uh, magazine into um, a homemade uh, pinhole camera. Um, I'm going to show my camera as my um, Fujifilm Instax uh, packs and how to attach it to your pinhole camera. Um, let me show you uh, my setup. This is my pinhole camera. This is a fresh Fujifilm uh, Instax uh, pack. Um, you're also going to need some tape, and that's all. Um, <coughs> okay, Just let me open this up. This is my uh, pinhole camera. It's just a cardboard box. I bought at the, the supermarket and wind it all up with um, duct tape. Uh, the pinhole is uh, just a piece of aluminium uh, drilled with uh, a needle, an acupuncture needle as it had the, uh, the right, the correct diameter needed. Um, it's, it has also been used, you can see here, uh, some uh, parts that have been used in the past for other purposes. This is this one is to hold um, the uh, the film or paper, photosensitive paper, uh, on the back of the um, the box. I used to have the pinhole uh, here, which I taped uh, for um, for this purpose uh, for the Polaroid uh, film. Um, I also had this place. Um, puncture to, to have a um, small um, catalog um, rod to to simply um, uh, reel the, the film. Um, this was for uh, taking one hundred and twenty film. Um, okay, let me show you how it's done. You have seen the, the camera, and I have here. Um, the uh, the other uh, magazine pack um, for as I used in my um, previous video. Uh, now this is another method I'm going to show you. Um, it's faster and easier to um, to implement, as you don't have to you don't need a separate uh, box to hold the magazine with the Polaroids, and as you only are exposing one Polaroid at a time. Um, <coughs> so uh, what I do is I will um, tape uh, this magazine to to the lid in this case to the back of your camera, and um, uh, every time you you um, have the, the the photo ready, you'll just push it along, remove it inside the dark bag, of course, um, and uh, use the method I show you uh, before uh, with the. Um, the tubing, the brass tubing, uh, they are, they are uh, pretty straight and they are uh, strong, which you need to be, so they can uh, push uh, correctly the, uh, the developing chemicals. Um, so let me show you how it's done, okay? Um, let me see if I can show you this without much fuss. We have the lid here. I'm going to open the card. This is the film package. This is the uh, protective cover. Uh, you'll need to remove it uh, for the first photo in the backpack. Um, you just push it like so and upwards. Uh, and it will come out of this side. So, um, what you're going to need is uh, the following. Um, some tape. Take a small amount of tape and roll it so you have end up with a double-sided uh, piece. Um, you want at least four contact points uh, for it to hold well, go uh, to the head.
is the back, it's ready to, to be taped to the um, the lid of your camera. Now what you do is sorry place the uh, magazine approximately centered uh, on the uh, the lid and it's well it's done. As you can see it won't fall and it's ready to use. And um, well, next step is to simply get your pinhole. Um, you'll notice uh, I haven't shown you yet, uh, or at least you've seen it, but uh, didn't realize what it was. Uh, this is just a, a small um, foot, uh, uh, support I made uh, because the the, the lid um, always stays at um, has some height here. Um, the camera will end up like so, as you can see here, um, uh, with a forward inclination. So by putting this way, it will uh, hold straight. So let me take this. Uh, remember, this is your downside, this is upside. So having this, I'm going to place it like so. And it's ready. It's ready to begin photographing with your pinhole camera. Um, I hope you've uh, you've enjoyed this this small video, uh, this how-to, um, and um, well, at least it will be easier for you to to take your pinholes uh, photographs uh, with the, the pull right back. Um, uh, you won't need a separate box, uh, light back box, to keep the the magazine. Uh, away from the light. You will simply need one um, one darkroom bag uh, to um, remove the film, the exposed uh, film from the um, the pinhole camera and um, process it process it like I, I've shown in my other video um, in, a, in a piece of um, a glass, um, flat glass and with the, um, the, the roll applying uh, force over the um, the film from the um, the chemistry side, uh, so it it spread evenly or the best you can. Um, see you later then, and have a nice year.